Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, and this is my 100th, 100th video on my channel. So this video I thought I'd, see as I'm going to be bringing back the minifigure reviews and stuff, review something massive. And, uh, ow, uh, yeah, I'm reviewing the Merlin Falcon from Star Wars The Force Awakens. Yeah, it's um, massive, but before I get into that, I will be doing the figures now. 100 videos, 100 videos. That is a lot, and still not that many subs, but still. Here are the figures that come with it. Well, this is Finn from Force Awakens. He comes with the, this um, mic thing and the gun. Boom, boom. And also, the backer comes with it, but his gun is like impossible to put on him, like really impossible. Like you can't even put it on him. So yeah. He goes with the cro the crossbow looks cool but you can't even put it on him. And my favourite part of this set, BB eight. Like like you've got a little BB eight that his head his head come on, I can't really show you that because my hands in the way but his head moves and spins and blah blah blah. Because you can see there. Anyway, yeah, that's the figure, the, the action figures you get. Cool, I already had a Chewbacca, but I didn't have a Finn or BB-8. Cool, though, but I... Anyway, let's go on to what you think. Now, I've used uh, the bigger camera that I usually use for my Q&As for this. Probably not Q&As, channel updates. But this, um, so, yeah. This is instead of using my regular one, which I just use uh, for reviews. Now, first thing is this whole back section here comes off the whole of the back by pressing two buttons that will all come off. And the still the detailing on this is amazing. And you can place it. I can't really do it because of this camera, but this can be placed on the floor and blah. If I just, that's meant to go like that, or no, you can do like that and have a little plate, but I can't do it right now because of the camera and look at the gun at the front is just sprung out, which Millennium Falcon doesn't have, but still a cool addition. Anyway, pop it, you can probably fit like two, you can fit like two figures in there, like Finn and I'm not going to try and put Chewbacca, that bit lifts up. You can get figures in there easily. There. And you've got to make sure to close it for like there. And then at the back. Oh, you just pop that up by pressing the button on the side here. Yeah. Then there's the satellite dish, which the new rectangular one, which I think can come off, but I'm not going to bother trying. Then there is that the, in the middle. There's this um, turret which you can slide if you can actually open it. Here you can put a figure. You meant to like slide slide a figure in there, and then she back is not going to fit. So then close it up. Then press. That that's about on the other side, and it will pop up. Uh, this doesn't have the actual one. And there's little guns here, and some uh, the main tower up there, which actually you push back down goes like that. You have to push it back down as well. And anyway, at the back, the one of this. Uh, at the back, this is going to be quite. A, there's a sleeping bay there. You can sleep in there. And then uh, I'm going to do this down there. And there's the where you can have the drag metal. There's another, there's a little hole there that goes through, it's meant to go through. And some weird, I don't know really what this does, but you can change it from red to green. I don't really know what that is, probably something we'll shout at me for not knowing. Anyway, that is basically all the features apart from I didn't notice this actually because. That can shoot nerf darts, but what, what, like, n not nerf dart. Yeah, like some nerf darts thing that you can, that are kept in here. 
and I'm obviously probably I'm obviously not going to do that yet. And the same on both sides. So obviously you want me to do this, but I'm not going to fire it on the camera. Let's do it load it up. Uh, and you fire. Wait, this is going to go horribly wrong. If the firing system actually works. Okay, this is going to go horribly wrong, I can tell you. Hold on a second. Yeah, I don't know why this isn't letting me fire the cannon, but... Don't ask me, just told me it's not working for me. Okay, at the back, there's a secret submuggling compartment. There's also, um, a cannon, which I'll go get, which goes there. Here's the cannon, it's here, it's a little blue. In the end, you just simply... Want it. Place it here, and it will go in and shoot, and you can get like, um, you can get thin, and everything's falling apart, and put him there. Now, if I actually did have the batteries and blah blah blah, really, you can It should make swooshing and blah 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 noises, but we don't. So yeah. Anyway, that is it. I think for this whole set. Oh yes, and I figured out what that was. It's the hyperdrive and BB-8 meant to the hyperdrive meant to be broken and BB-8 meant to blah 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 fixed. That's how you fix hyperdrive, guys. Anyway, that is it. If you want to see another massive or not massive or any minifigure related Star Wars related or anything, please like blah 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 subscribe. To do whatever you want. I don't actually care. But anyway, if you want to see another massive unboxing, please do like that video and subscribe. Blah blah blah, I'll be probably doing more of these. And that is it for this video. My 100th video, 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 I will see you hopefully in another video. Hopefully we get to 200. Good. Bye!